from Considine's, the place next to Mango's, what's that called? I think it started with an H. Well, whatever it is, I think it's really great. And I'm ready to rock jams, surrenders, bums, or squatters. The weather's pretty hot, but this beat is even hotter. Autobiopathy, this is me, spit psychology, more current than lobotomy. Autobiopathy, this is me, less femininity than pure masculinity. Autobiopathy, this is me, a cacophony crashing the economy with psychobotany. Autobiopathy, this is me, an experimental, monumental, fragmental polymogamy. The third act's the most tense, will it all fail? The heroes on the ropes of fate put an end to this tale. In this saga, a deus ex machina surely won't come. And as the forces are massing, he starts to feel numb. But the super post keeps on, it seems almost like heaven. He looks for new horizons, have a puppets and the attic, have a drama in the gallery. We're climbing on the stage. The first book's completed, but it's just the artist's first page. And so it goes, the art begins, yet more art. Life follows, so the horse is definitely before the cart. And as your laser reads this, this for the head reads your platter, I'm gonna keep rhyming lines that for some will matter. Autobiopathy, this is me, this is me, this is me, this is me. Autobiopathy, this is me, this is me, this is me, this is me. Autobiopathy, this is me, this is me, this is me, this is me. Check it out. Ghost Nebula. And the... A certain crustacean knelt above his life station and took the matter up with the creator of the world. Now the creator was a being of compassion and well-meaning, but he sent his hands were tied once the project was unfurled. Grumbling is a creature and left without a spring in his step because his dimples skip when your legs number six. So we hatched the scheme to climb above his knees before telling you what. Let's get the chorus in the mix. Joshua, the argumentative lobster. Joshua, don't want to be Now this friend of ours wasn't the type to frequent bars, but on this particular night in question, he found it necessary to enlist a special emissary who's gifted in law and elocution. Jeffrey the Blue Whale was more precise with the detail than he was with that large fin of his, so he gathered the facts as his thoughts were stacked, but he told Joshua that they were in biz. Joshua, the argumentative officer, Joshua, filed a petition with God. Joshua, the argumentative officer, Joshua, isn't this a little bit odd? Court is in session, 
prosecution do your best to show the jury why your client shouldn't be? With pleasure, your honor. My client's hot and bothered, forever outstripped at the bottom of the sea. He asks for bigger fins to match those hands of his, or else he shouldn't be in the sea at all. He doesn't feel at home, crawling blindly and alone, killing time, gnawing on his own damn claw. All right, you've made your case, and to put you in your place, the defense is represented by the being called God. Well, this is the go tell us again. Just let you tell us that this guy isn't happier away from Cape Cod. He's part of a family, a crustacean, so you see, he's never been alone in this world. This planet that we're on has been done some wrong, but humans do much more with their obsession with pearls. All right, my little friend, don't forget your happy trend to munch on muscle, keeping their numbers in check. They'd be bad if I let out that your enemies, no doubt. All kinds of fish go hungry if I showed on torture's peck. You're part of an ecosystem, you are a gift to them. I've made my case and will pursue my seat. Both sides have now been heard, and though it is absurd, will Joshua win or will this be defeat? Joshua, the argumentative lobster. Joshua waits as the jury deliberates. Joshua, the argumentative lobster. Joshua waits as the jury deliberates. Thank you very much.